Hello, this is Palico Padge, and welcome back to another episode of the Curious Expedition with mods. We are playing with the Doctor Who mod. And, well, we're kicking it, to be honest with you. We're doing very, very well. It was, I wouldn't say it was a rolfler stomp. I think is how the kids say it. However, it is something which I have found when using the Tyrannosaurus Rex mod, which we had installed as a pet. Uh, it was a little bit too easy. So, in the last expedition, we got rid of the Tyrannosaurus Rex. We brought in Jim Sterling, or Jim Stephanie Sterling, I think he's calling himself right now. And, well, we, we still survived. I wouldn't say it was as fluent as it was before, but... It, we, we did all right. We did all right. So, what we're going to do now? We can go to the mysterious jungle. We can go to the defiled drylands, or we can go to the lunatic desert. Now, as we are playing with the Doctor Who mod, and we are doing all right, okay, standard, I suppose you could say, with portals. I think we should play the portal game this time around. I mean, look, we've got a portal there. We've got. No portals there, but, 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 pray tell, we have two portals here. So, I reckon we should crack onto the Lunatic Desert. I mean, you've got to be a little bit loopy to go into the desert anyway. Probably more loopy still to go into the Lunatic Desert. Let's find out, shall we? After a brief stop, the TARDIS was fully charged with Artron energy, and I was excited to continue my adventure. All of time and space lay at my feet. Soon after my arrival, the hunter approached me. Oh yeah, we killed Snarfrattle as well. There you go. Have a pelt, friend. He handed, blah, 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 blah. We handed over not Snarf Rattle's pelt. He was he was sad, apparently. I mean, why? You've tasked me to go out into the wilds to take down your nemesis in animal form. You no no more than that. You've paid me to do it, and now you're sad. Well, I can't take it back. There's no Texas backsies when it comes to Snarf Rattle. Sorry. I was handed new funds as a token of gratitude. 80, that'll do. Uh, as we were getting ready to depart, the hunter that approached me about the giant lizard before I last year. Oh my god, are you still on that? You, I've given you some teeth. I've, well, I've given you one tooth to be precise and I've sold the rest. But I, even so, I've given you teeth. There's no need. There's no need for any more. You've just been greedy now. Down goes my fame. Never mind. A trader approached me with a request. He tasked me to acquire a rare idol. I'll give it a go. I'll give it a go. I'm not one to turn down the challenge. And, uh, oh, speaking of turning people down, who do we have? Uh, we have uh, Dada Bai, Baba, the trader. We have Mala Sarabiji, the translator. And we have Vivian Montane, the artiste. Um, I mean, are we are we suffering with anyone at the moment? I think everyone's pretty hunky-dory overall. I don't think anyone's got any major negative traits, if at all. You know what? If it ain't broke, don't fix it. No, thank you. Just in time, the vessel was prepared to sally forth. Right, so we got lots and lots of money. Let's do this. What do we want? Well, we want all ugh, tinned. We're going to take the bread. We're going to take all of the tins because you never know. We're going to take all the dynamite because that will stack. We're going to take all... Are we going to take all the first aid kits? We're going to take all the first aid kits. Now we're going to take all the torches. Uh, we're in the desert. It's going to need some space for uh, uh, water. Uh, so let us take the rope. And... Hmm. You know what? We've got the money. Do I really want to spend 200 funds on on rope on climbing gear i probably don't in all fairness um what about the signature rifle it's gold it looks cool so what's that uh so one two three four five so we will be full oh we, hmm. will we be full we will be full we've still got tickets good times But that, um, okay, well, no, we, we, I, I have the problem of having too much and not enough space. So let us um, let's not worry about the rifle. Uh, the bullets weigh. I mean, I could always drop the spider legs. I'll tell you what, let's take one less medikit to make sure they do stack all right. Uh, the rest, I'm pretty confident, will be okay. 
and we'll just try some of these instruments. They might be one time only. I have no idea. We'll find out. Let's go. Let's go. Oh yeah, by the way, it's Expedition Five. If you're if you keep it count, we're off to the desert. It's going to be warm. Oh, and here we are in this submarine. Good times. Top right of the map. That's not too shabby for us. Let's have a quick look. It's a long one. It's a long one. The TARDIS materialized with a thud. Um, let's have a look. Oh, I will never speak of the terrors I found deep within the TARDIS. Oh, it's worth a punt. Okay. Uh, well, we need water. Is that homeward bound? It is right. So, I mean, essentially they do the same thing, don't they? TARDIS recon and homebound. Hmm. Maybe I hold on to some things here. What would I drop? That says emergency only, so I'm going to leave that here. That brings the TARDIS to us. But however, we've got the homebound, so there's no point taking that. I think that's good. Oh, we don't need the tickets either. Have all the tickets. Uh, yeah, and then we shall take more water. Good. Good. Uh, let's go. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Let's go. All right. So, oh, yeah, we're at the top. Uh, let's get on. Uh, let's uh, let's get up onto the hills. Um, possibly a cave, being so early into the game. Yes, yes, yes. And, oh, a mission, which is completely useless. We have the dinosaur right on us. Mm, so we might lose a region down here. That's fine. You know what? I'm dwelling too much. We located a cave. The rocky moor led into darkness of unknown depths. We needed a torch in order to venture forth safely. Oh, it's a tunnel. Where are we going? Yes. Okay. Well, that's... Uh, yeah, that's, that's fine by me. That is fine by me. I mean, we've got one question mark here we've missed. But other than that... Could have been a lot worse. Could have been a lot worse. Let's see what's going on over here. We might be fighting a panther. Or not. They're avoiding me. My reputation precedes me. We approach an old campsite. There were debris of what seemed to be a failed expedition from long ago. The skeletal remains of what must have been an Italian explorer stared at us through cracked eye sockets. The bones were arranged as, as if to tell me something. Be gone, evil one. My instinct said we'd find something of value. Let's have a look. Fireworks. Alright. Alright. Well, we'll take them. We've got space. Um, right, so, onwards and upwards. Let's eat some tinned food. Really? Maybe I should have bought some machetes. Right, it's a little bit of work to be done over the water. I can't see any geysers, which is good. We could possibly enter from the bottom as well, but we'll get to that in a second. Let's um, let's have some tinned foods and explore, eh? We'll try a rest. We prepared camp and I told people to rest. The team eagerly gathered wood for a fire. What is strength? What is fortitude? How would one measure one forte? Private Derek Jacob took my philosophical musing quite literally and challenged me to a fist fight. I mean, alright, we've got a pretty good chance. Huzzah! Twice over. I beat him, of course. I could see respect in his eyes. Awesome. Uh, I will probably end up putting Nicardo up in a second. Uh, do I want to rest again? No. We'll make it up in strawberries. There we go. All right, so let's promote you. Awesome. And um, I think we should probably head, because we can cut across there. Yeah, let's head to this question mark here. See what this is all about. Oh, it's a tomb. We're going to be carrying a mummy. 
Hmm. Hmm. Let's um let's get rid of the water. A small pyramid just barely reached out of the dunes. It must have been some kind of grave built by a long forgotten civilization. A small opening led into the darkness. We entered the dark tomb. Mankind had not set foot here for hundreds of years. In the centre of the room lay a stone sarcophagus. We'll open it up, damn it! Dust and decay filled the air as we pushed the heavy lid off the sarcophagus. Inside we discovered a fully sorry, start again. Inside we discovered a perfectly preserved mummy. All of a sudden it started to moan and limp. I can't limp on the camera uh, towards us. Let's roll. Hmm. I mean, we could throw a stun out. How many die do they have? Three. How much health does it have? 20. Not a good start. Um, Let's throw a stun out. We'll hold on to two of you. And we'll roll again. Right, so we've got a kick. We'll hold on to the precise and another one of those and roll once more. Meh. Meh. So you and you. Alright, this could be painful. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. All right, so uh, let's do an, two more stuns and a kick. We're definitely going to throw out a shield this time. Hold on to you. Once more. Four health. All right. Oh, bugger. Well, I pressed the wrong button. Only... <laughs> <laughs> our only hope was to run away. Oh, oh we lost our homebound. Oh. Ugh. All right. All right, we'll take it. I've, I've created some space, I suppose. Bugger. Uh, right, so. Um, bugger. Let's crack on, shall we? Uh, we are going to go to the cave and completely forget about what we just did. Oh, my life. Oh, it's only a waterfall anyway. Come on. I deserve it. Whatever's going to happen, I deserve it. Uh, one moment we were totally alone, but an instant later we were surrounded by weeping angels. Our only hope of escape was to maintain eye contact. Oh, this could be nasty. Ozy nosy. I valiantly struggled to keep my eyes from blinking. I swear I only closed my eyes for a moment, but suddenly I found myself in a completely different location. Well, we found the portal, and I would presume the pyramid. Uh, that could have been a lot worse. That could have been a lot worse. All uh, right, so I need to redeem myself. So let us um, eat all of you. We'll get as close as we can to the hyenas. Take them out. I'm smarting a little. All uh, right, we're going to throw in a dynamite. That's what we brought it for. Multi attack on you. Two left. So you're gone. No hyena down. You're gone. If I hold on to you as well, we, we cover ourselves on what could possibly be on both those die. So you're gone. I'm going to throw that out just in case. Uh, I'll hold on to one of you. Uh, there's irony for you. All right. Well, it doesn't matter at this point. There we go. All righty. Oh, we've got quite a bit of sanity off that. Uh, we'll take it all. Oh, we are overburdened. Okay. Um, let's fire some fireworks and go to the tomb of course come on bring it on bring it on time to redeem myself right roll oh.
it's not the best if i'm gonna be completely honest with you i mean what it's asking of me here is to just shield up shield up and up and up um oh uh all right no all right fine there we go that's it that's all i can do that's all i can do that was lucky all right uh take a look at what we got seven it's another kickable offense We'll throw a stun out just in case. Yeah, we're all right. Tippity top. Give me that mummy. One slight overburden. Can we get to the to the mission? We can. Uh, let's give it to the meat. All right, here we go. Somebody is infected. Ah. Oh. Jim, Jim, uh, you need healing. There we go. Right, so no, Private Derek. He's a soldier. He'll be fine. Right, let's uh, let's get into the mission. Do you have anything that's worth bartering for? Well, arguably, more cans. He likes his cans. Uh, what else? I mean, if we get rid of the spider legs. He's not a fan of the spider legs. That'll do, I suppose. Create a bit more space. And uh, we want the storage room to get rid of you and you. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. And uh, let's get out of here. Let's go, go, go. Um, let's go up top. I mean, we're here now. We might as well explore the oh lordy, explore the full area. Um, do we want to fight the tiger? Yeah, why not? Just the one. We got this. Oh, uh, right. We'll start with a kick. Uh, I'll follow up with a couple of precise punctuation type hits. Do I hold on to one of you and you? Throw another kick out there. Probably a defensive uh, maneuver. Cut of a post. Let's see what you're worth. Nothing. That's what you're worth. Nothing. And uh, we'll take it all. We can carry it. Why not? Uh, well, we're going into a cave. Let's go and have a look. See. Oh. We found a small cavern jumbled with the aftermath of what seemed to be a failed expedition. We found the rotten remains of what must have been a French explorer. Wee, oui, wee, oui, wee. Oui. Uh, what do you have? Oh, more cans. Also, a gold as well. Wowzer. Yeah, I'll take all that. Can we... Uh, get rid of the meat. Can we go back? I feel this is the time to go back. I mean, we've got one question mark there. We've, we do have about half a region there to, to discover before we can move down south. Infected. Okie dokie. Let's deal with you. Righty, righty, righty. So, I, mm, I'm thinking. I mean, how much are they worth? 20. I'm thinking we do that. Just to top ourselves back up on the... Uh, the, the heels. It's quite early on in the discovering of this entire map to be using up too many medikits and I don't want to be caught short low on down, especially when it's a bloody Tyrannosaurus Rex around. So uh, that'll do. And then we shall also drop off you and you. Oh no, just you. I mean, what's worth more? 5 and 20 against 2 and 5. So that's 8 and 20. Uh, I think I'll swap those over. Uh, and uh, we're done. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Uh, let's go and see what's up here. I mean, that's a nice wide 
angle away from the Tyrannosaurus. Hopefully when we get up on the hill we'll be able to see a little bit more of the surrounding area as well, which will help. Hey, hey. Not a lot more, but a little bit more. Uh, I'm going to have to have some tins. And move over a little. And have some more tins. And examine the shrine. Uh, 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 narrow staircase, fungus, and rope. What a combination. After securing everyone, we successfully scaled the towering shrine. We arrived at what seemed to be the treasure chamber. It was a truly awe-inspiring sight. Our steps echoed as we approached the sacred altar. Another moonstone. Nice stack. Voodoo dolls. I mean, why not? And uh, a golden beauty. Mmm. First one patch popped from the ground, then another, then more and more, and it kept growing. The growth was so forceful, the ground burst open, and where it opened, it turned red. Ah, uh, I sense spiders. I sense spiders. All right, so I think it's time we ate this bread. Getting sanity won't be an issue uh, for a while, so let's eat the bread. Oh, it's not worth a lot anyway. There we go. And uh, move on to what I suspect again could be. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. I don't like that at all. I want to go this way. I suspect it could be. Oh, I was going to say it would be a pyramid, but it's not. It is a camp. And uh, we didn't move far enough. Bugger. Let's do it. Oh, eat you as well. We arrived at a native village. The villagers looked like a shamanistic group. We entered the settlement of a nomadic tribe. As we arrived, the whole village was bowed before a mysterious looking idol. While the team unpacked our equipment, I observed the rites with interest. Idol, idol, idol. Right, so uh, we want to trade. Surpri I mean, were they super angry with us? They are. Uh, surprisingly, not a lot here. Surprisingly. Uh, bartering and spider legs standing of plus seven uh, I will take garlic no onions right so I will take the mangoes you can have the voodoo doll I will take the berries Uh, I don't want the cocoa leaves. T too many negative things c can come off that. Uh, we freed up two spaces, but we're taking up two spaces, which will be consumed soon. We really want to get up to plus two. So let's give them some teeth. That'll do. Everyone's happy. We unpacked our belongings and prepared to spend the night with the natives at their campfire. A girl came running into the village crying loudly. Apparently a young mother had died. The whole village was in mourning. Rituals were held throughout the whole night. Do I want to steal straight away? Probably not. Let's sleep once and then we'll rest again. The night was quiet and peaceful. The following morning, I was awoken by a group of native children, surely poking fun at the strange foreign fellow. Our time with the natives was a delight. They remained friendly and offered us some help. Or more help. An elderly woman placed some food by the idol. So let's do this once more. Oh, there's a wedding now. Awesome. So they're going to be annoyed if we leave early anyway. So we might as well steal the bloody idol and get out of here. Mine. Twice over. We filched the idol rather covertly and departed the village under the cover of night. Tip top. And on that note... Oh, spiders on us already. On that note, we shall leave it here. I mean, there's going to be a lot of spider fighting in the next episode. I can guarantee that. And we've got about a third of the map to go and also find that bloody pyramid which we haven't seen yet so thank you for watching as always the like is appreciated and i shall catch you on the next one take it easy